In the wild marshland surrounding the pristine greens of the Olympic golf course, warning signs to locals and tourists alike. Don't feed the animals, because this is an animal known for its appetite, the alligator. We only saw one or two during construction, and that was in the wetland area. And right now what we have is they've been breeding. And we, went and we noticed last year, down behind number 13, there's like a breeding pool. And there was at least 20 or 30 babies in there. It's the natural cycle of native life on a golf course or, or on land in general. Alligators are an increasingly common sight in this part of Rio de Janeiro. With hunting now banned, numbers have almost doubled in the past five years. So much so, alligator spotting is something of a daily sport for locals. But are they dangerous? So. Yes, they are. I've never seen anything happen here because no one would go down there. They're not crazy. Once a dog ran away from its owner and went down, it never came back. On this stretch of water which leads straight to the Olympic golf course, we've seen five alligators within about 100 metres of each other. And the worry is that as these waters become more polluted, with ever-increasing construction, the reptiles will go on the hunt for cleaner territory elsewhere. Indeed, the day before we filmed here, an alligator from this lake near the Olympic Park was caught at a nearby shopping centre. Man and beast are getting dangerously close. The alligators are losing their habitat. They still have a lot of space, but they'll end up looking for other places. If there's a child alone on the street, for example, it's possible an alligator could attack them. There are no registered attacks on human beings, but it could happen. The real risk is for an alligator crossing the road and being run over. Inside the controlled environment of the golf course, local wildlife is likely to be little more than a sideshow. I'm sure it'll take a lot of TV pictures and it'll, it'll show, uh, the golf course will be shown around the world and news clips here, there and everywhere if, if some of the alligators do seem to appear out of the water and onto the golf course. But uh, I'm sure it'll be well marshaled and there'll be some procedures in place. The warning to travelling spectators is the same at the golf course and beyond. Take any snaps from a safe distance. If you don't disturb the wildlife, it won't disturb you.